Hello, this is Photography Gamer. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm reviewing Stubbs the Zombie Rebel Without a Pulse for the PS4. This version has been remastered from the original version. Stubbs the Zombie is a third person action game developed by Wide Load Games. Stubbs wakes up from a 50 year sleep and returns to the land of the living as he gets revenge on those dastardly people who woke him up. The game can be played in solo or in local multiplayer. So what is it like to play? Well at first you've got only a few weapons at your disposal. From basic melee strikes to knock people off their guard, then you can eat their brains and watch them turn. But as you progress the game gives you a wide array of creative and silly methods to take down the living. Zombies can be herded together by using the whistle function. Great if you want to set them loose on a group of armed police. <laughs> Stubbs can drop a bomb, a fart bomb, to wipe out nearby enemies. You can also use a gut bomb, take off your head and bowl it down to the foe's location to blow them up. And you can also take off your hand and run around and do a bit of mind control on an enemy. It's all pretty hilarious at times and good fun for the first few levels, but I would say the game does quickly show its lack of like level variety. But it's got a good sense of humour, it's pretty good fun. Yes, it is repetitive, but it does, did put a smile on my face. And you know, who doesn't like eating some brains and hoarding up some zombies to attack civilians? Love it. <laughs> Visually this remastered version doesn't look that much different or better to the original really, but it has you know, a nice cool retro art style, a fun presentation and some very entertaining mini games. In terms of audio that hasn't been remastered and the quality is really not very good at all. And some of those sound effects that really could blow out your eardrums because the level of the volume compared to other games is way higher and really coarse. Okay, the good and the bad points. Good points are, the game is fun with a quirky sense of humor. The varied ways you can attack enemies is cool, and it's a silly game that doesn't take itself seriously, providing some laugh out loud moments. Bad points are, gameplay is quite repetitive, the audio has not been remastered, and the visuals, they're fairly underwhelming. Right, what's the verdict? Stubbs the Zombie is a solid zombie game where instead of killing zombies, you play as one and create your own horde of zombies too. It's fun while it lasts, but it's not the classic that I remembered when I played it originally. Still, it's worth a look if you see it on sale. It's quite funny, quite entertaining, but also a little bit repetitive. So my score for Stubbs the Zombie is 6 out of 10. Okay, that was the review. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe to the channel or become a patron. This is Photography Gamer signing off. Thank you.